Hey everyone, so I'm going to be making my shrimp and rice meal today. Um, I just opened up the shrimp. I have to soak it for a while and thaw it out. So what I found, they have these inside the bag. <laughs> Little butter things, I guess, going with the shrimp. Um, so, oh, and excuse my shirts on backwards. <laughs> okay, anyway, um... So I'm going to show you my spices. I got this, a little bit of the Saison Goya, a little dash of this that I just got, olive oil, a little dash of this. Um, this is going to go on after everything, the yum yum sauce. This is the light version of it. I've never even tasted the real version, I don't think. I might have, but I don't know. A little bit of this. And then Himalayan salt, which is holding up the camera, so I can't move it. <laughs> so the, the rice is, uh, the water is boiling. Shrimp is soaking. Um, I'm going to cut the shrimp up to make, kind of not make it stretch necessarily, but I just, usually when I eat dishes with shrimp, um, I, I always end up biting like one or two pieces off of the shrimp. So it's like, I just rather have it cut up prior. Plus it makes it stretch a little bit. Um, it makes it seem like you have more shrimp. So, you guys, we're gonna see how this works out. After the rice is done, I'm gonna mix um, one of these butter palettes in there. <laughs> or should I just do this one? This um, Irish bread. Maybe I'll do half of this and half of that. But anyway, um, my meal will be done soon, and then I'll post a picture of it. Um, yeah, you know, I'm, I haven't really used minute rice in a long time. I usually was using the boil in the bag, which is pretty much the same thing, <laughs> I guess. But I was going to try to do on the stove the regular jasmine rice. Um, but I just was like, I don't want to wait all that time. kind of hungry. Um, and then I have an MIA rice cooker. But, but anyway, you guys, I will... Uh, keep you updated. Um, talk to you guys later. I hope it all tastes good. Cause this this shrimp is like butter, salted butter, garlic sauce shrimp. So that's kind of how they wanted you to use it, and they put the butter palettes in with the shrimp. But since I'm going to be putting this on it, I don't know if it's going to ruin it or what. But we'll see. I doubt it. But anyway, um, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Okay, so the rice is done. I put um, the rice in the boiling water. But I'm wondering why when I tasted a little bit of the rice right now, it was like kind of hard. <laughs> so I'm going to see what's going on. I hope it, I hope some, like a lot of the water didn't boil down while I was talking. And then I just put, you know, some of it boiled away. So I just put what was like too much rice into what was left of the water. I hope not. Otherwise, I'll have to make you know, fix something, fix it up. But let me cut this shrimp. I want to cut it and season it. So I just take these are already deveined and peeled. Shell, shell off too. Or tail off, or whatever they call it. I was debating if I should cut the shrimp after they were cooked or before, just because sometimes when you do it before, it crowds the pan. But shrimp, like most seafood, cooks so fast that. Before I blink, it'll be like pink already. So. I don't want that rice to sit too long because um, I want to put the butter in where it melts in there. So look, you guys. Well, I'm gonna like put the camera down in a minute. The shrimp 
It looks like double now, just because I cut it up. Now I'm gonna, after I'm done with this, I'm gonna season it. I'm gonna like bathe it in olive oil and season it. Oh, is this a, um, I hate how, like, there's that front part. Okay, so now I'm gonna get the pan ready. Okay, so, I'm gonna drain this. I don't want the phone to fall over. Hey Google, stop. Okay, so I'm gonna put a little olive oil just to coat. Okay, that alarm was for the rice. So let me bring it over here. I'll be back, you guys. Let me tilt the camera a little bit. Y'all, I kind of feel like a rice cooker would have done better. Okay, let me mix this butter stick in, or this butter that came with the shrimp. It came with three little pout. Pats of butter. Okay, I kind of, right after I left Lawrence, I was like, dang, I should have got, oh, uh, see, what is it called, so, not soy sauce, um, what's that sauce that, um, is for, like, rice and, like, um, sesame oil. But it was like kind of high at once. I was like, I've been at so many stores. I could have got a cheap bottle of Walmart last night. So I didn't get it. I didn't think I needed it. But when I think about. But you know what? Because I'm doing the yum yum sauce anyway. I'm just gonna. That'll probably be enough oil anyway. Okay, so this is kind of like bathing the olive oil. Is bathing the, sh the shrimp's bathing in the olive oil, and look how much shrimp because I cut it up. It looks like there's a lot more. I don't want to put my hands in this. Okay, I need to put the pan on. Okay, so now it's time to season it, put a little bit of this, that might take over, so I don't want to put too much of that, a little bit of Higoya adobo, plus like I remember that the butter they put in there is gonna add some salt to it. So, um, the Malibu seasoning, all purpose seasoning. This has like chunks of herbs in it. Oh, I can't get the Himalayan without moving the camera. Okay, you guys, I will be back. I'm gonna get all this on the stove and uh, I will show you the finished product. All right, here's so far the seasoning. <laughs> You know me, I go overboard. All right, talk to you guys later. Bye. So here's the finished product. A friend of mine suggested I do a first taste of the things I cook on camera. So I'm going to do that. Because this is just the butter, shrimp, 
with seasonings and the rice. And it has an kind of orangey color, probably because of the adobo. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to get this plate ready. Alright, so my plate. It's like all shrimp right there. This rice looks more like couscous or whatever it's called. Do a little more. Okay. And now I'm going to add this to the mix. Yum yum sauce. Okay, stir it around. And I know. They, these, they have this at, they call it hibachi restaurants, and they usually have a little chicken, steak, seafood, but I'm just having seafood. Mix it all up. I can smell that mayo. Oh, hey guys, I'm going to take my first bite. I don't know. I think I liked it better before I put the um, sauce. Or maybe I put too much sauce. Let me take one more bite. It needs for me like rice and shrimp. It needs like teriyaki sauce or something. Add it into it. Mm. Guys, I can't eat. I can't eat gracefully. All right. I'm gonna finish eating, and I will post this later. Thank you for watching. Bye.